one of the most asked questions in our exhibit, once it gets underway, people want to know what's in the little dishes. We have two dishes, two types of food dishes for the butterflies throughout the conservatory. The first, the smaller dishes that are on the silver stands, those are what we call nectar feeders. And they're sort of like fake flowers. I put colored beads in dishes with some sugar water. And you'll see butterflies feeding on those um, sometimes several at a time. And then we have other dishes that we place on the ground. And that is uh, rotting fruit. Doesn't always look very pretty, but we do have butterflies such as the morphos. They don't nectar on flowers. They really take nutrients from rotting fruit and fruit juices and that kind of thing. Now, people wonder also, you know, do I need this in my yard? And the only reason that we have those dishes in the conservatory is that throughout the exhibit, we will have more than 7,000 butterflies flying. That's not at one time, but throughout the exhibit, there's a lot of butterflies to feed. So besides the plants that we have in the conservatory, the dishes are a supplemental food. Guests will get very concerned if they see a butterfly that isn't moving. Um, they, it can be laying on a leaf with its wings open and it's not moving, it's not doing anything. It could be on the pathway and not moving. And I guess it's a, a natural thing for guests to be concerned. Um, but many times butterflies are still for very specific reasons. They're, they may lay still with wings open and that is a way for their bodies to collect heat that is radiating from a surface, be it sun-warmed bricks or a sunny leaf. They will also be on the path, perhaps, um, because their proboscis is probing for moisture from the soil in between the bricks. Um, there's many different reasons for a butterfly to be still, and it does not always mean that they are hurt or wounded. They are just being butterflies. This year's exhibit, we're looking a little bit more at how butterflies fly. And different types of butterflies, different species have different flight patterns. For instance, the morpho, the big blue butterfly that everyone loves, um, it has a very lazy, gliding type of flight, but when threatened, if it feels that there is a predator or the male butterflies are doing a territorial thing, um, their flight becomes very erratic, very darting, and you will see flashes of blue. And for a predator, this is very confusing. They don't know where the butterfly is. So in that case, the uh, flight pattern is actually a very good defense. We release butterflies um, periodically throughout the day, sometimes many times throughout the day. After the butterflies emerge in the emergence area, they will fly to the windows, they will you know, fly down to the pads, they will be off of their, their perch. And at that point, um, staff will go in there and very carefully collect the butterflies and put them in a carrier and bring them out of the bungalow and release them into the conservatory. We have uh, release times posted and the release area is right in front of the bungalow, nice sunny spot. So guests will be able to see a release and know when the release will be. A lot of people ask what happens to the butterflies at the end of our exhibit. Um, I start getting butterflies in, in February, but I stop getting butterflies in near the end of March, the first week in April. So all those butterflies just live their natural adult life within the conservatory. Um, even after our exhibit is over into May, we will still have some butterflies lingering. 
but the butterflies die off naturally at the end of our exhibit. And we wait and open up the conservatory and get out of containment when that last butterfly has expired. If anyone has any other questions about the exhibit, they can always visit our website, www.meyergardens.org. Or if you're in the building, if you are walking through the conservatory and you're watching the butterflies, um, feel free to ask docents, ask staff. We are always happy to answer any further questions that visitors have.